When my channel reaches 50k subscribers, I am going to be giving away a Mermaid Halo 2020. So make sure you subscribe so that we can reach our goal faster and I will be able to give this Halo away sooner. A big shout out to everyone who bought my merch. Thank you guys so much for supporting me. A quick reminder that I just came out with some new designs, so if you're interested and have Roblox to spend, I do have some pretty cute clothing out in my Roblox group currently. All of my merch and my Roblox group will be linked in the description. Love you! Hey Royals! Welcome back to my channel! If you're new, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to join the kingdom! In today's video, I'm going to be spilling some tea about this game that everyone on the Royal High Twitter is talking about. The game is called Crown Academy, and the rumor is that they copied a lot of elements from Royal High. However, this is still up for debate, so in today's video, I'm going to be investigating and seeing if this is true or not. I would have loved to actually go in the game and play it to see, However, in order to play the game, it cost 200 Robux. So, I'm going to be using photos of proof from Twitter as my evidence, and hopefully it'll be enough to decide this. This is an image of the park in Crown Academy, and as you can see, there is a fountain, and a lot of people are saying that it resembles the fountain from Royal High quite a bit, which I could see, but it's a fountain. I mean, they all look pretty similar. This is an image of a headband from the game called the Miss Academy headband, and again, a lot of people were saying that it looked like the Dear Dolly headband from Royal High, which I actually agree. I think they look very, very similar. In the game, there is a map that allows you to teleport to different areas of the game, which is a very common feature to have in games, but people were complaining that it looks similar to the one in Royal High, which is a little bit of a stretch, but I see what they're going at. This is a screenshot of some of the game passes available for purchase in Crown Academy. They are similar to the ones of Royal High, but a lot of games have game passes that allow you to get more currency. The thing that bothers me most about this is the pearls and diamonds similarity. Crown Academy is also a dress up game like Royal High, so there are many skirts and shoes in the game. And you can definitely see slight similarities between the ones in the game and the ones in Royal High. I think the main similarity that I noticed was in this picture of someone playing the game. This is all from Twitter, by the way. Their sleeves look almost identical to the Gothalita sleeves in Royal High. Which, again, they aren't exact copies, but you can definitely see that they were inspired. In Crown Academy, there is a pair of shoes called the Darling Wedges, which sound a little bit like the Darling Valentina heels. However, they look almost identical to Dear Dolly heels, with the socks and ruffles at the top to the crisscrossy straps on the shoes. This pair of shoes in Crown Academy is called Fluttering Butterfly Legs, which is pretty similar to Fluttering Butterfly Heels. This is a screenshot of the shop in Crown Academy. I actually noticed two things, the first being that the shop's layout and format does look a little bit like Royal High Shop, but not too much. And the other thing I noticed is that one of the hairstyles for sale does resemble a pair of bangs from Royal High. There is also a skirt in Crown Academy called Royal Sass that looks pretty close to the real life mermaid skirt in Royal High. However, in the description of this skirt, they do credit Royal High for inspiration, but people do say that it looks like a copy. The description of this skirt is that it's inspired by the fictional character Kinomoto Sakura. This is what the character's skirt looks like from the illustration that I saw online. It does look like the skirt, but it's also able to be said that it looks a lot like the Dear Dolly skirt from Royal High. It's hard to tell which one they took inspiration from. 
So obviously, Royal High fans have brought up all of these similarities to the developer of Crown Academy, Pixelated Candy. However, instead of apologizing and taking down some of the similarities, or even explaining how they happened, she's been consistently arguing that the Royal High fans are toxic and they just don't want competition. Matt Crystal 3, one of the amazing modelers for Royal High, has actually asked these developers to take down some of the items, but they have said no. Pixelated Candy clearly does not like all of the bad feedback they've been getting on this game, which is understandable because they obviously put a lot of time into it. The real question is, did they really copy Royal High? If so, that would definitely mean that this game should not be allowed on Roblox because they were stealing ideas. But it's possible that they were taking inspiration from other things outside of Royal High, and there's no real way to tell. What do you think? Do you think this game is a little bit too similar to Royal High, or is it original enough to be its own game? Let me know down in the comments what you think. I love you guys so much, and I wish you all a great day. XOXO